Hello everybody, welcome to the Hacienda of Rivet here. Today we're making something fantastically delicious, but then again we're always making something fantastically delicious. Today we're making Spanish seafood stew. They're made with whatever is the catch of the day and they will almost always include some sort of shellfish and mussels which are very popular in Spain. In this case we've got shrimp, mussels, on the left we have some cod and on the right we have some flounder thawing out. So stick with me and let's see how it's made. First thing we're going to do is make a fish stock uh, with the skins of two yellow onions and a couple tilapia that I bought. We're just going to boil them down. In Spain the stock was normally made with any trash fish that came up on the uh, nets of the fishermen and uh, seawater but since we have neither this will do just fine. Alright, the first thing we're going to do is sweat two chopped onions in a generous amount of olive oil, followed by about five or six uh, smashed garlic cloves. Alrighty, after we've sweated our onions, what we've done is added the strained fish stock that we made. And to that fish stock, we're going to add about a cup of uh, good sturdy wine, in this case some Bogle Chardonnay. This is uh, going to be a little bit of signature to the Spanish seafood stew. All right, now that we got the soup at a boil, what we're going to add is about two cups of peeled and diced potatoes. Now, I will say this about that. In all the years that I lived in Spain as a kid, in Vigo and Seville, I never ever remember diced potatoes in seafood stew. Now, that doesn't mean it's not good, and we like it that way here in the Hacienda, so we're putting them in, just so you know. Okay, after adding the potatoes, we've reduced the heat to uh, bring it to simmer where we'll cook the potatoes for about 15 to 20 minutes. And we're going to add two generous tablespoons of kosher salt, two generous tablespoons of dried sage, and one generous tablespoon of Spanish smoked paprika. Okay, now that the potatoes are cooked, is we're going to add the uh, pound or so of raw shrimp and the cod beautiful delicious flounder and this is a softer fish so it'll fall apart so I'm going to put the steaks in just like so and then of course the mussels we have that so we've got this going we're going to bring it to a boil we're going to cook everything through and shazam we're ready Spanish seafood stew sopa de pescado y mariscos que bien okay so here we have it Spanish seafood stew with your mejillones, your bacalao, your plateao, your camarones or your gambas, your vino, your pan, and any kind of firm flesh fish. And there you go. That is Spanish seafood stew. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it.